Hi everyone. Today we're going to go over the minimum stock notifications and setting all that up. So right here on the main Trackmicity web dashboard um, under company, we're just going to go to users and we're going to go ahead and set up whoever needs these um, notifications. So I'm going to set up myself. So right under notifications, you're going to see this uh, receive minimum stock alerts. Just go ahead and make sure that is checked. And so that whenever a um, one of those alerts is triggered, it's going to show up here under the notifications menu. So if I flip over to the mobile application now, we can go ahead and get started by setting up an item. So we'll run to our inventory item list and we're going to just select an item that we know we want to set a minimum stock notification on. So we'll do Cisco and we'll just do a 16 port switch. Admins are going to see this edit icon at the top right. So if I hit that, I'm going to bring up that detailed page. You'll see minimum stock quantity. So let's say I want my stock quantity or my minimum stock quantity alert to trigger at three. So I'm just going to go ahead and hit save. I'm going to go and let's say we'll go ahead and just check this item out. So we'll do from warehouse and we'll select a client just select that same Cisco switch, we'll check it out, we'll jump back over to the web dashboard. And now you're going to see that notification gets triggered. So if I select that, it's going to say that the minimum uh, stock level has been hit for this Cisco um, SG-110. So as soon as I get all that on order to make sure my stock is replenished, I can either hit clear all or just um, delete a single item at a time. So I'll just clear all. And that's minimum stock notifications.